So on uh, the Faith and Freedom radio broadcast, Matt Barber and Matt Staver are two absolute morons, religious right-wing crazies. They are the very definition of fundamentalist wing nuts. And uh, they were responding to evangelical religious right groups being listed among various kinds of religious extremists. And they were listed in an Army Reserve briefing, and of course the Southern Poverty Law Center, which monitors radical groups like this, they said, you know what, this is a hate group, you gotta watch out for them, right? So listen to what they had to say in response, and then we'll talk about it. Left-wing extremism and anti-Christian bigotry are alive and well, and the Southern Poverty Law Center is fanning the flames, Matt. And you know where this is going? It's just like in Nazi Germany. What did they do? They ultimately painted this straw man of the Jews and the people that they didn't want as part of their preferred society. Uh, they dehumanized them. Uh, they ultimately fanned a, an environment where people hated them uh, so that when they ultimately did take their lives, people turned a blind eye and people agreed with that. That's why we've got to push back on this radical redefinition of language and redefinition of ideas. Look, it's, it's Republican 101, right? Play the victim as you are the one victimizing people. So, uh, oh, you're, you're gay and you wanna get married to somebody? Well, you're not allowed to fucking do that. I'll, I'll make sure you don't, you're not allowed to do that. I'll withhold rights from you so that you can't get the same tax benefits as married couples. If your spouse dies, even if you've been with them for 20 years, you can't collect their social security. I'm gonna make sure that you are treated as a second class citizen. And then if anybody dares make a peep of, hey, you know what, maybe that's not such a good idea. Oh my God, you're a bigot. How dare you say that I'm wrong on me? I'm, I'm a victim, I'm a victim, I'm a victim. No, as I always say, there's a difference between uh, being tolerant and being tolerant of intolerance. No, you need to call out the intolerance when you see it and drag them into the year 2013. And uh, here's a radical idea. Maybe you're considered a hate group because you're a hate group. Maybe uh, going around and telling people that you're not allowed to, to be treated as an equal because uh, you, you like somebody that has the same genitals, maybe that's hating, right? I know, radical. Maybe uh, being anti-abortion zealots like these guys are, right, uh, that they give uh, house to people that uh, would end up committing atrocities at these uh, abortion clinics, for example, remember when George Tiller got killed, abortion doctor, we have a tremendous amount of abortion clinic bombings in the United States because of wing nuts like these guys. Maybe that's why you're on the hate list, because you hate, right? And then I love, they always do it, man. They always do it. If they slightly disagree with you on anything politically, well, you're a Nazi, obviously.